What a career it's been for the pride and joy of Swisher Jessica Heim. She'll make the trip to Paris later this month for the Paralympic Games. When Jessica was born, she had what they call amniotic banding. She was actually born with a partial foot. We had a lot of problems with it when she was a year old. We actually amputated the partial foot that she had and has been wearing a leg ever since. I just like running like the mile at school and I just thought it'd be really fun. It all started as a nine-year-old with the Cedar Rapids Track Club. What a journey it has been for former Prairie and you and I standout discus thrower Jessica Himes, who will wear the red, white, and blue for the third time at the Paralympics in Paris. I kind of keep pinching myself and have had to remind myself a lot of times since trials that I'm actually going. <laughs> but it's an honor to go to any games, but especially three different times. Himes, a former KCRG Athlete of the Week, competed in her first games in Rio, where she also ran the 400 meters. Four years later, it was Tokyo and now Paris. Himes has shattered her own world record in the discus more times than she can remember. Uh, truthfully, I stopped counting, I think, after five. Maybe that sounds bad of me, but I think I'd say six or seven official times right now, which is a lot, and that's exciting. <laughs> it's an honor I wear. <laughs> Himes, who is now married and a discus coach at Southeast Polk, isn't quite sure if this will be her last Paralympic Games. I don't know how many more I'll have. Maybe I'll retire the second I get done in Paris. Maybe I'll keep going 15 more years. We have no idea, but I'll enjoy every second of it. Jess is a role model and a true inspiration to others who have disabilities. I really hope I am, and I hope that I can do my best to be a role model for these people. And so many little girls are running around. There's even a little amputee girl now in Swisher, Iowa, where I come from, that is watching me on TV now and knowing that she gets to grow up with someone else who looks just like her and doing things that she might want to do someday. That's, that's an honor.